here we are at another mountain. Meadows Massacre site. Well, not another one, but another memorial, I should say. This one was also built, built by the Mormon Church. It's quite nice. The weather is so nice. Hey, little Joe. I know. Gravesite Memorial, built by and maintained by the church. Did you see that thing about the bones they found? Yeah. Am I interesting? Built by and maintained by the church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, out of respect for those who died and were buried here and in the surrounding area following the massacre of 1857, dedicated to September 11th, 1999.
Kelly. We're going to head out there. Out where? Out there. Okay. Okay, well, I'm coming. Mom, was there any other markers in there besides this? Oh, they do? I mean, on the black Oh, I didn't notice that. that. That was about the place where they circled the wagons. Uh huh, I read that part. Yeah, so they tried to, some of them tried to escape. That's sad. marker in honor of those who rest in this field they were innocent and died in the unjust attacks it began on September the 7th 1857 they were defending their friends and families and buried them before they knew the protection of their camp to the other victims of the mountain meadows massacre who lay in unknown graves rest in peace and be assured you are remembered Mm -hmm. You know what to do if your lens cover is slightly cracked open? Like, not cracked open, like broken, but like, it's kind of just a tiny bit open. His ears? Wow, I didn't realize they knew the exact place. Execution at the scene of the crimes in September 1874. A federal grand jury indicted nine Mormon militiamen for crimes related to the siege and massacre. Some of those men immediately went into hiding in fugitives as fugitives from justice. About 50 other militiamen were involved in the massacre, along with an unknown number of Paiute Indians. Only one, John D. Lee, was brought to trial. March 23, 1877, almost 20 years after the massacre, federal officials took Lee to the scene of the crimes. Not far from this very spot, he was executed by firing squad was buried in the cemetery about 120 miles from here. Poor guy. I mean, he wasn't the only one that participated in this. He shouldn't have been the only one executed. What's that? Oh yeah, this is cool.